What is up everybody, it's your boy Kyle right here, and we are back with MW3, and this video, honestly, I'm just making an MW3 video because I feel like playing Call of Duty. It's also great to find out, you know, that I'm fucking calm banned. I don't even know how the hell I got calm banned, because I woke up, got on Xbox, and then it just said I was calm banned, and I'm sitting here confused, I'm like, how, the, how in God's green earth did I get fucking calm I, I wish it tells you how you got calm banned. I thought I used to do that, but I haven't been combat in like four years, so. Modern Warfare 2 Remastered, well, was out, and then Activision just like annihilated it quickly, which I can understand why people said fuck Activision. I mean, I kind of did say it, but to be fair, I didn't buy the game, so I'm not like really pissed off like some people, but I can see, but I can fucking see like people saying fuck them. They like bought the game. Oh, you fucking pussy. Um, because I would be pissed too. But here's the thing. I can understand why they were going to get taken down. I mean, a little bit of me, like, knew it was going to get taken down. Come on, like, a lot of us knew. If you actually, like, really thought about it. Because it's going to take away from, like, their newer game, aka Black Ops 6. And, well, here's the thing. People can be like, oh, what if they just fucking, you know, oof, let us fucking play it like right after the game comes out or at least like three months after after the qu a fucking honeymoon phase well here's the thing it's still gonna take away sales no matter what no matter when you release it it's still gonna take away sales you can literally release it in the dead center of the fucking like i'm talking about where it's the same amount of time when the newer cod comes out that year or when the cod that just came out this year it could be dead center of it, and I get I guarantee you it's still they're say it'll take away sales. It will take away sales. No matter fucking what, it will still take away sales. It could take away one singular sale, they'll fucking boot it down, no matter what. And I've seen FaZe Jeff's video on it. It's Jeff, he was talking about like community and shit. Like, for example, people are like trying to build a community and shit. Look, from a multi-billion dollar company that just wants money which is like every multi-billion dollar company this this th dude this fucking world is ruled by capitalism with companies and shit you take away from their main source of income that they fucking their newly like made game that they you know spent all this time on yeah, they're going to take away the newest things they are going to take away from that fucking newest game, which I can understand that. Even when the newest game can be fucking jet like shit, they're still going to fucking promote it and still like in some way, shape or form going to make everybody play it. I mean, yeah, it sucks that, you know, nobody's able to really play it. I mean, I don't have a PC. I know, right? Well, YouTuber doesn't have a PC. Haha, ha, ha, eat my dick. I don't care. But like, I still want to at least play it once. I mean, I feel like it would be like, cool as fuck to play it because i've seen clips of it i mean it looks sick i've seen uh what was it who's fucking who did i see on twitter I've seen somebody on twitter that said the servers are back up like look like i feel like that's a lie though that they said the servers are back up because this was something that's kind of big i forgot who the fuck it was um i'm not playing rust but they were talking about like the servers being back up they showed a picture of it and well here's the thing i feel like that's a lie considering that you know because here's the thing considering that nobody else really said anything about it i scrolled through twitter i searched up call of duty or like the h2m servers and shit all it's it's all it's about is just saying fuck activision that's all it's saying i think they're like cap and they're just trying to get fucking recognition which hey i mean it happens i guess they're always gonna have that one weirdo it's just gonna do it maybe he's right maybe i'm just sitting here yapping i mean that's the only reason why i made a fucking call of the yes i know my chat is disabled um i can totally like know that it's still down because they're not just gonna look like i said about multi-billion dollar companies that care about money in their newest product like a few other people you talked about is literally they're just they're not gonna give a fuck look you can tell you can tell them to go fuck themselves all they want you know what they're gonna sit there and do not give a damn that's like every fucking multi-billion dollar company they don't give a shit they don't give a shit about you they don't give a shit about you unless you're fucking elon musk then maybe just maybe 
still take in some consideration and throw the fucking note that you gave them away in the fucking goddamn trash. I mean, you can go by, you can go to other people that rant about this, you know, that are more popular than me, man. I'm just trying to do my thing. Sorry that I just like making YouTube videos. It's a fucking habit. It's weird to me that people use snipers in hardcore, which, like, it, it kind of weirds me out. I mean, I can understand Loki the car. Because the car is can be a hand marking machine. I mean, you gotta hit their upper chest, which is totally understandable. That's what you're supposed to really do. But I think, like, I would still use it in, like, core. Because you missed that fucking bullet. You're so cooked. And plus, that doesn't help that everyone, like, almost every weapon... Like, every automatic weapon is a fucking one-shot. I, I think that's just, like... Here's the thing. They shoot first, and they shoot faster. Like, that's your biggest issue. See, that shotgun guy? You're not gonna be able to fucking aim in. You gotta have everything that helps to aim down sight speed. You're still not gonna be able to aim in it fast. And to be fair, I didn't play Modern Warfare 2 when it, you know, was in its prime back then. I mean, literally never really played it, because that's when I never played Call of Duty. I started playing Call of Duty when Black Ops 1 was the newest COD, so... I mean, technically, it would be still in its prime. It's usually CODs back then. Their prime was, like, literally a year after. I would say the most recent COD, where their prime was, like, a, at least a year after its release, was Modern Warfare 2019. A big thing for it was Warzone. Because it's, they correlate together, so... I mean, technically, it correlated with Cold War as well, but mainly to modern warfare 2019 but it's multiplayer is fire i don't care i fucking love that multiplayer dude a fucking goddamn nade for a final kill is just a w i hope you guys enjoyed me ranting about call of duty and shit it's whatever i like ranting i guess i don't know if you like it i highly doubt it but i hope you guys enjoyed this video like subscribe do whatever and yeah see ya